Hey everybody, um, I'm going to be teaching how to do this race to the top puzzle. I do have a cough, so I'm sorry, because that will probably get annoying <coughs> during the video like that. So try to ignore my coughing. I'm sorry about that. So the goal of this puzzle is you guys are going to fill out all of the white triangles by combining the like terms below them. So for example, here, x plus 2x equals 3x, so they wrote the answer up there. The reason that it equals 3x is because x has a value of a single x, 2x has a value of two single x's. So when you combine all of those x's, you have x plus x plus x, or 3x. We're allowed to do that because these are like terms. They have the same variable, which is x, to the same power, which is that they don't have an exponent at all. So they have the same variable and no exponent. So you're allowed to combine them. Let's move down one. Here, we have 2x and negative x being combined. So I still have my 2x's from before, and now I have a negative x. x and negative x are opposites, so those would cancel out, leaving us with just the single x as our answer. You could also think about it as, ne or I'm sorry, not negative, regular 2 plus negative 1. That matches up with the 2x. Let me fix my pen. That matches up with the 2x plus negative 1x. Negative x is just the same thing as negative 1x. So you're really just concerned <coughs> about the coefficient in the front. 2 plus negative 1 is positive 1. Therefore, the answer is positive 1x. But we just write x. We don't write the 1. Let's try this next one. Now we're doing negative x and negative 2x. I'm going to erase that. So I have a negative x and I have a negative 2x. Negative x is just a value of negative x. Negative 2x you could break down further into two negative x's. So I'm combining negative x from the first one plus two negative x's from the second one, which gives me a total of negative 3x. You could think about it as negative 1x plus negative 1x plus negative 1x. That equals negative 3x because negative 1 plus negative 1 and negative 1 is equal to negative 3. So you really just add the coefficients up and then stick an x on it. This one be negative 3x. Um, there are some special cases. Like if I look down here, I have x and I have negative x. There's no coefficient on it, so I have one of each. They're opposites, so they're going to cancel out, which leaves me with zero. So you are allowed to have zero in this worksheet, and you would not put an x on it. You would just keep it zero. As you guys keep going up the uh, triangle, it's going to get um, smaller and smaller. As you go, you're always adding the two white triangles up to get the answer above it. Um, go ahead when you're ready and pause the video. And then when you're done with your triangle, come back and unpause the video and you could check your answers with mine. If you want a little bit more help, you could just keep watching and seeing my next couple of answers as well. All right, so hopefully you've paused the video at this point. You can kind of skip ahead um, my explanations if you want to. Um, if you've already done the worksheet, if you are still stuck, I'll explain a couple of more of these. So the next one is going to be negative 2x and positive x. So we have negative 2x and positive x. That's like having a negative 2 and a positive 1 that I'm combining. <coughs> negative 2 combined with positive 1 is going to leave me with negative 1. I could also think about that as negative 2x is equal to negative x and another negative x. Positive x is equal to just positive x. So these guys will cancel out, and I'll have one negative guy remaining. x plus x is equal to 2x. This is like adding 1x plus 1x. So 1 plus 1 is 2. We've already <coughs> done this one. This one is negative x plus 2x. You could think about it as negative x and positive 2x's. 
we have two of them that cancel out. That leaves us with positive x. Then here, 2x plus 2x. You could think about it as x plus x plus x plus x. Or think about it as adding 2 plus 2, which is 4. Then stick the x on it. That's 4x. At this point, I'm just going <coughs> to give the rest of the answers. Sorry, taking a drink, so I hopefully don't cough as much for you guys. So just to keep going, I have 4x. I have negative 2x. I'm just going to keep filling these in. Now, if you have something different than me on that line, the whole top of your triangle is going to be wrong. So go ahead and pause the video if you need to and correct the rest of the triangle before you keep looking at the rest of my answers. I'm going to keep going now. Same thing here. Pause the video if you need to correct the rest of your triangle. If you have one mistake, it messes up everything above it. Keep going with the video when you're ready to see more. I'm just going to keep going, but pause the video at any point if you need to correct your answers before you keep watching. But I'm going to stop saying that so it doesn't get so annoying. Almost done. Finally. Great job if you got that. If you didn't, that's okay. It's just some practice. Thank you guys for watching this video.